Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams and we're going to do some binomial distributions on Minitab. We're going to figure out how do we find the probability that we have less than or equal to a number of successes in our sample. So we have a recent survey by Knights of the Round Table and they found that despite rumors to the contrary, only 40% of dragons can actually breathe fire. So in order to determine the size of their fire brigade, they carefully took a random sample of 20 dragons. We want to know what's the probability that nine or fewer dragons in the sample can actually breathe fire. So we know we have a binomial distribution because we have a 40% probability that they can breathe fire, which means there's a 60% chance they can't. We have 20 trials in our sample of, or our sample of 20, and we want the probability of nine or fewer. So when we look at that, we're looking for the probability that x is less than or equal to 9. So we're going to let Minitab do the work. So here I am in Minitab, but before we get started, we've got to figure out what our input constant is. So we're solving for the probability that x is less than or equal to 9, because we said 9 or fewer. So if I look at my binomial experiment, and I have a maximum of 20, and a minimum of zero successes. I'm going to look at nine and put nine right here. So I want less than or equal to nine, and so this is what I'm looking for. I'm actually looking for the probability from nine down to zero successes. What the cumulative distribution function in Minitab solves for is the probability that x is less than or equal to x, where x is our input constant. Well, what we're doing is exactly what this cumulative function in Minitab does. So 9 becomes our input constant. In other words, we're solving in the same direction as this CDF in Minitab. So all we have to do is put in 9 as our input constant and let Minitab do the calculation. So I'm going to come up to Calc come to probability distribution, and I'm going to go to binomial. So I want a cumulative probability because I want um, the sum of all the probabilities from 0 to 9, and I had 20 dragons, or 20 trials, probability of success, then breathing fire was 40 percent, and my input constant, we said we were solving for less than or equal to 9, and then I say OK. And so what Minitab tells me is that the probability that nine or fewer dragons can actually breathe fire is a little bit over 75 percent, or 75.53. The important thing to remember when using this CDF in Minitab is what it actually solves for. Right? And it solves for, and will always solve for, the probability that x is less than or equal to whatever that input constant is that you enter in the dialog box. So hopefully with that piece of information, all your binomial calculations will be easy. As always, I hope that you found this useful, and I thank you so much for watching.